So, red four. Unfortunately, this um, I've heard this game isn't really very, very, very good. Um, I've not looked too much into the reviews, but apparently it's a dud. But that's not going to stop me from trying it out. Now, I have played maybe the first half hour of the game. And uh, I did kind of enjoy what I was playing. Like, I didn't hate it. Um, this isn't a game that I usually... This is this isn't the type of game that I usually play uh, but I did enjoy it and I thought you know what it's a new game I'll stream it on the channel and see how it goes um, I tried to look into like resetting my progress but unfortunately I do not know how I don't know how to reset my progress uh, like I can't start a new game I wish I could start a new game for you guys um Honestly, I could potentially be able to. I'm not entirely sure. Did you design this character? Does it look like, does it look like a character I designed? I might try, I'm going to try that. It looks like something you designed. There you go. <laughs> um, the character does remind me of my, of, of Opal from um, uh, Palace of Quest. But yeah, no, she's one of the main characters, one of the main playable characters. And she's like front and center in the promo. And I was like, yeah, that will be who he plays as. You know what? Damn, right. Yeah. So there was another character and he has a skill set. That was like, oh, this is perfect. This for me, this is like my play style. But then I looked at Layla. So that, that's a, that's her character's name, Layla. And I was like, no, but she looks cool though. And so I decided to go with that. Instead, sinking data, don't sink data, don't sink data. Ah, so unfortunately I won't be able to start from the game, start the game from the very beginning, uh, but you didn't miss too much. Um, so depending on, wait, hold on, actually. New he new hero is a new campaign, maybe? So these are the characters. You've got Jacob Boyer. Jacob moves like a ghost. After years as a special forces sniper, he flipped to corporal corporate contracts working with Bell Bellwether Security. That gig eventually brought him to... Hold on, I'm going to turn this down a little bit. Brought him to uh, Redfall, where an encounter with one of, with one of the vampire gods left him with strange powers and a ghostly raven companion. Growing up as a foster kid, Jacob is used to tough situations, but the conniving vampires on the island will test his limits. Uh, Layla Ellison. Layla's mind is a telekinetic weapon. She came to Redfall to attend the local university, but after volunteering for a shady medical study by Avon Therapeutics, she emerged with some of the vampires' amazing psychic abilities, though none of their but though none of their appetite for blood. The, her graduate school plan was to study vascular mechanics on the way to a biomed degree, all in the name of helping people. Now, thanks to her special powers, Layla finds herself in a desperate struggle to save the remaining survivors in the living shadows of Redfall. Redfall. Devinda Dev Crowsley. Dev is an internet famous cryptid hunter and ghost chaser. From his home in the UK, he spent years documenting the weird and the hidden. After visiting Redfall to promote his latest book, Like a Mothman to the Flame, Dev finds himself trapped with no way to stream to his eager fans. Relying on his eccentric inventions to confound and destroy his enemies, he's as shocked as they are to find that, AT, that at last his fringe technologies actually work. One part terrified, one part fascinated. Dev searches for a way off the island 
or at least away online. And then Remedios Remy de la Rosa. Um, Remy has dedicated her life to rescuing people from disaster zones. Disaster zones, though vampires are admittedly a new twist. As a combat engineer with a degree from MIT, uh, Massachusetts Tech, um, she and her prototype robot Ribbon were an obvious choice to train Coast Guard personnel uh, in Redfall. What? In Redfall on bot assisted search and rescue. As the eldest in her family, Remy sees herself as a protector, the one to rely on. She will use her technical expertise and everything at her disposal to help those trapped on the island. Except the bloodsuckers. Um so those are the characters. So if I choose create hero, that's a brand new campaign. Okay. So I go here. What? Right. And then confirm. I didn't play the game. Okay. So this should start the game. Yes. What happened in Redfall is my fault. I think it used to be a nice town. I may move the camera depending on where I um, got here. I thought I could help. They said one drop of my blood could change everything. Free people from sickness. Sorry. Maybe from death. A world where nobody was left out. Cups overflowing. Rivers of living water. I was a fool. Okay. They were monsters. They took more than a drop. They took everything. Now, something evil is swallowing up this place bit by bit. When the people here realized what was going on, it was already too late. Folks are at each other's throats, begging the monsters to spare them. Some are just hiding, scared, waiting for a rescue that ain't coming. Some tried to get away. But the monsters who started all this weren't having it. There's nowhere to go. Nobody ever believes things can get this bad until it happens. Then it's too late. But there are people who can fight back. I think they can save this place. There's just one thing standing in their way. A whole town full of vampires. So I have seen these opening scenes. And y'all will know when I get to the point where I stop playing. They're really going to town in this dude.
Hello. You can. Oh, it's quite bright to look at you. No one can. And so she's known as Black Sun. Belong to us. The others want you dead. But I want you here. Alive. I can use you. See the sun again. Oh, oh God. So, if anyone's played House of Ashes, if you remember, like when the sun, or when there was an eclipse, so the sun's out right now. Eventually, that sun gets eclipsed proper hard. How many times I wanted to get off this island? Just like it does in the House of Ashes. Got to finish college first. Way to go, me. All right. Medical supplies? Yeah, I'll definitely need that. All right. So this is Layla. Um. So when I played before, I really hated how janky the controls were. So, is it controller? So, there was a fix for it, uh, which was to. put input response to low and raise controller sensitivity. Don't know about how much. I'm gonna raise it to four. And that feels a little bit better, a little bit better actually. Um, so unfortunately, um, the game runs at 30 frames per second. 30 frames per second. I needed that. Um, and that is the case for the game on Xbox on launch. On PC, it runs perfectly fine. It runs at 60 frames per second. Might even download it on my PC and try it out. Um, but yeah, it doesn't run as smooth as I'd like, or anyone would like. But it's fine. Like, if you used to, it wasn't that long ago where most games were playing at 60, 30 frames per second, so it's okay. Um, do, 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 do. There's a lot of notes and shit you can find, and I would love to read all of them, but I actually really want to get to the point where I was. Um, I'm trying to see if I can find most of the stuff that I found before. There's a missing child called Everett Doyle, last seen leaving the Harvest Festival with an unidentified person. 5 1. Da, 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 da. Use our code word backpack and she will trust you. That door's locked. We have to go. That's locked too. Like I know where I know where I need to go, but what's this? That's the note. I can't exit that way. Thought we'd all make it out of here. I've seen enough movies. I should have known better. <laughs> That. Interestingly, it's not showing me like any it's tutorial prompts. Water wall. Why the hell not? Which is interesting. Also, this game has this stupid like virtual mouse cursor thing, and it's really annoying. Um. Yeah, it seems like it saves the tutorials are account wide. So it saves. Right. 
Um, why am I here again? There we go. To get a gun. I don't want to shoot anybody, but I might have to. So it says break glass. And then I can go upstairs and open this door. To unlock that shortcut. I'm not sure I would need it, but yeah, it's there. What happened to the sun? Total eclipse is what happened to the sun. Where you learn about uh, sneaking around. The new gods of this shitty world. Last time I was actually able to sneak around. Don't fight us. Well, the Hollow Man will come for you in the dead of night and leave you empty. Anybody. A dried up bag of skin. Okay, I think I made it through. Though there's some guys over there. Come on, hurry up. Hey. Hey. Someone, Someone see me. Oh, oh shit, hey, hell's up. I don't like how long it takes to like heal. That's annoying. Picked up medical supplies. Really? Finish up with these containers. Then check the ferry. So like I made it, I did, I made it like quite a ways before I got spotted. Everyone, yeah. Flare Flares. I think someone needs help. Also, sorry, what's this? What in the texture is this? Just you two? Okay. Easy. Ooh, flare gun ammo. I don't have a, I don't have a flare gun though. Eliminate all cultists at the fire station. Nearly there. So this is at this point, this is where the game was like, play your way. And you can get into the fire station by going through the front door and fighting all the enemies, going through the rooftops, or like using a lockpick, which I haven't found actually this time around, uh, to go through the back door. Um, there was a ladder I found, so I'm gonna go that way. Sneak on it. There's no way out of this. Take a look at the sun. 
Oh yeah, I was able to sneak around this, guys. It was also nighttime last time I did this too. I need to get in that building. I don't know if I can like stealth kill anyone. Someone there. Nope. No one's home. Just need to get in here. Firefighter of the Year goes to Ga Galo Fasse. Recognition, recognition, recognition of your courage, strength, and valiance. Massachusetts State Fight Firefighters Association. Um, it is dark in here. All right. So upstairs is progress, if I remember correctly. This is the, the travel bag. This is the back door that I could have used, so I'm just gonna unlock that. Also, shit. Also, close it. <laughs> Some people out there. Uh, I could also get an early shotgun from a place. Going down here. And there's nothing to worry about because I know there's no enemies in this part. Shotgun somewhere, I think it's here. Oh, right here. Sweet. And I found a weapon with a stake too. And that will come in useful. Basically, um, you could fight vampires, obviously. And in order to defeat vampires, you have to like kill them, but you can't kill them conventionally with a weapon. Once they're like downed and wounded, you then have to like go up to them and run them through with a stake. Um but you have to have a weapon with a stake attached. So the handgun doesn't have one, but the shotgun I just picked up does. Uh, but if you fail to pick up that one by exploring first, before you fight your first vampire, there's like one right before it for free. Um, sorry, I'm looking for an ambulance that has a med pack in there. Uh, and I need to go upstairs. Hello. Hey, is anyone in there? Yes. Hello? We're in here. Are you... Are the cultists still around? I can't open this door until they're gone. Oh, Dad. Dad would be better. They cut the power on us. We've got wounded in here. And they got a bloodsucker in the basement. They all answer to it. Can you help us out? Are you here to help? We'll come out if you get the power back on. Uh, so they've got a bloodsucker in the basement, which is down here. I'm just going to sneak. Sneaky sneak. Now there is a, like I said, there is a free shotgun in here. Which I'm going to use. Well, I'll change weapons.
Hello. Oh, yeah. I alert everyone. That that didn't happen before. Well, that's fine. Oh wait, shit. I've got to do something. I've got to turn the power on. safe now. You're safe. Mission complete. And that's basically the first mission. But instead, I'm going to leave. Uh, so I want I sped run that 20 minutes, 21 minutes. I did that about 12 minutes faster than I initially did. Uh, so what I want to do now is go here. Can I delete? I want to delete that. So now we can start with this hero. As in this safe file, which is the one I initially started, but now we're back and caught up. Lovely jabbly. Oh, well that's fine, because I have spares. Fully charged spares. So I'm after I killed my vampire the vampire, I learned a new skill. Uh, I believe it's called. I can't use the skill now, right now. I'll show you guys later. Um, also, I don't know if the settings carry over or not. Yeah, they, they do. So apparently, this is home. This fire station. We've fortified it. I've not gone anywhere. Where I quit the game is where I stopped playing. So, like, anything from here on is, like, new to me now. Oh wait, this is the basement. Cleaned up. Hello. We'll get our home back, even if we gotta fight for it. Especially if we gotta fight for it. They took over the hospital almost immediately. Like they planned it. They took your hospital, bro? Hello, Terence Hunt. 
Miss Ellison, I'm so happy to see you. Dr. Hunt? Oh my god, I'm so glad you're okay. I don't want to think about what would have happened if you hadn't shown up. I'm taking care of everyone here. Sick, injured, and everything in between. If you need medical supplies, come to me. But only take as much as you need. There are other people here who need help just as much as you. What a strange situation. I'm trying to figure out the best place to put my camera. I'm starting to think it might be top right. Some of your... Yeah. Some of your allies in the fire station run supply caches. Uh... Where you can spend support to stock up on useful items like medical supplies, lockpicks, rewire kicks, kept those flares. and weapons. Check back occasionally since the inventory changes over time. You can earn support by collecting supply items or salvaging weapons. So support is basically the, the currency of the game. Yeah, I reckon the top right. the best place for me to put things yeah because I can't see my ammo well I mean I can't, I can't see my ammo need. so that. I've got other patients let's move it there Because now what can't I see? Yeah, that's fine. I might actually, what I might do. Just a quick fine, fine tune. Slightly down so I can see the currency. Oops. Otherwise, it should be fine. I appreciate what you've done for us. We need to get the people here safe and secure. <sighs> so I can buy medical supplies with supports. Open my, open my backpack. Oh, is, that a sh clap is that a shotgun that I just have? Hold on. Right. Yeah. Killing an enemy with this weapon, it grants it 20% increased damage for 8 seconds. I'll take it. It's unrivaled. Talk to Rev Eva. Good luck somewhere. Okay, you're not going to talk to me. Ask Alison Pregnancy Edition. Folks made fun of me for years. Lucky for them, I don't hold grudges. I'm generous like that. <sighs> Say goodbye, Joe. Goodbye, Joe. I don't, don't need to talk to you guys yet. Where is the rep run? You look reverendish. Ava Crescent. You must be Layla. I'm sorry you got wrapped up in all this. We all got wrapped up, didn't we? I'm Reverend Eva. It's nice to meet you. Sorry it couldn't be under better circumstances. We were at the homeless shelter before this, but... Anyway, 
I do the organizing around here. Sending people for supply runs, scavenging, getting people to safety. Sometimes they bring back useful stuff. Check the trunk from time to time. Whatever's in there is yours, if we can spare it. I sent someone out to find food, and they brought back 30 doodle donuts. Come <laughs> on! Right. Uh, Revelations of Divine Love by Julian of Norwich. Lost and found. So I don't have money for anything, really. Like a tool, what is that? Lock picks and rewire kit. Kind of reminds me. I've played Dishonored at the very least, so it kind of reminds me of that. I say I've played it, I've not finished it, but, but it reminds me. Um okay, what next? Anna. I'm not doing your funeral, so don't die. Layla? Nice to meet you. You too. I'm Anna. And this is my husband, Joe. You ran into one of those creeps, yeah? Only way to kill him is with a stake to the heart. Makes them pop like a firework. Those loonies, you can take out with a regular gun, though. And we got plenty of those. This stake's free, but you gotta earn the guns out of my stash. Sorry. She's not sorry. <laughs> I ain't sorry. Anyway, nice to meet you. So, picked up a steak. Nice. Ah. Is that just like an item? So, what? Hold on. Confused. Bah. Things would have only gotten worse. Bye bye. So, we've got cultists on our hands as well who seem to worship the vampires. You can spend money to refresh the supplies. Ref as in, if you don't like anything that's been sold, you can spend money to recycle. Uh, but none of this means nothing to me because I have no money. I'm broke. So I'll leave this alone. Okay. I never like the sun anyway. I burn easy. <laughs> Use the briefing table, which is somewhere. Ooh, that's a wall. Over here. I picked up an outfit set. You just received a new stake you can use to customize customize the look of your weapons. You can equip your new stake by pressing da -da to load up screen, selecting the weapon as a stake attachment, select the weapon details. You can also change the skin, you can change your hero's outfit, customize. Just explore where blah. So let's go here. If I go to details, that's what the weapon looks like. Sweet. And then what? I can change the state or the skin. Why can't I do either? Alright. There are other heads I can get. For Layla. Layla was drawn to this t-shirt due to its feminist message, but she wasn't expecting to use that inspiration to kick it, to kick ass and kill vampires. What does it say? Bite me? Uh-huh, yeah. And that's just the top. Oh, that's a nice top, but I do like the iconic purple. So far. Uh... Yeah, let's put that back. I mean, I 
didn't have any plans after school, but... Yeah, this wasn't really something that I was expecting. So this is like the, is this like the first day of it? Briefing tables upstairs, I guess. Mission briefing room. Choose the next mission you would like to accept. Can only have one active at a time. Cannot repeat message missions. So, two birds, one stone. The people hiding out in the Redfall fire station need supplies if they're going to survive. Guns, ammo, medicine, anything to help. A few stores downtown, a few stores downtown might have what they need, but keep your eyes and ears open for other opportunities. Okay, this much is true. One, my name is Layla Ellison. Two, Redfall is full of blood-sucking monsters. And three, I have these weird powers. I probably should have started with that last Otherwise, one. Otherwise, there's a lot of things I'm not so sure about. This whole town was fine until like a week ago. A week ago, okay. I was doing my master's degree. Everything seemed normal, except the missing people. And the weird symbols everywhere. And how no one went out at night anymore. Okay, I should have noticed this sooner. Some of us tried to get away on the ferry, but these monsters broke the sun and sucked all the water away. Because of course they did. Now we're all trapped here. On an no island. Coming to help us. No one is going to tell us what to do. The people hold up here need supplies. In and out, downtown, just to pick up some stuff. It'll be easy. <laughs> Right? Layla's design is so awesome. Like, can't even pretend it's not. Okay, so what, do I just leave? I think this is the I think this is the room they were holed up in. Yeah. All right. Just like track and field. Use your Redfall map to get your bearings and navigate to objectives. Press that button to open the map. See objectives, points of interest, historical markers, safe houses, pings. Place pings to help you navigate or point out goals when playing with friends. I would like to play this with friends or people. Actually. I think it would be fun. They'll never know what hit him. 